everyone, welcome to Cook School. I'm Chef Nicole, and today I'm going to show you how to achieve wok hay at home on an induction stove. So, this is good if you do not have a gas stove at home. You can still do your favorite Ipoh Hofa noodles, which is uh, what I'm going to show you today. So, this is what we'll need for today we'll need canola oil, Ipoh Hofa noodles, and Hofan sauce just to top it off. So, now that we have everything that we need, let's get started. First, I'll add in a little bit of oil and I'll need to heat up my wok until it smokes. So you want to make sure that your heat is high enough so that the wok smokes. So this is how you get the wok hay or the breath of the wok. So mine is at number 8 and you can see that it's starting to smoke. So I'm just gonna add in a little bit more oil and then swirl it around the wok and let it smoke again. So once you see a lot of smoke, it's good to go. Add in your hofa noodles. And toss. If your wok is not hot enough, your noodles will start to stick. So you want to start off with a really hot wok. So once your noodles are light brown in colour, they're done and you can turn off the heat. I'm going to transfer them into a bowl. Okay, so this is my Ipoh Hofa noodles with wok hay. Wok hay basically means breath of the wok or the smoky flavour of the wok. It's actually best done on an open fire on a cast iron wok. But uh, it's also actually really easy to do on an induction stove. It might not be almost the same but it's uh, good enough. Okay. So I'm just going to top it up with some homemade hofan sauce that I've done. I just did it with some beef stock and cornstarch and a little bit of oyster sauce. You can also add in beef and whatever of your favourite vegetables, but I'm just going to use the sauce just to show you how it looks like at home. And there you have it. This is how you achieve wok hay at home on an induction stove, using Ipoh Hofa noodles. 